Newlyweds Matthew and Lauren Yuri had hoped for a relaxing holiday. Jesus. But today a court heard the Americans were instead forced to run for their lives as their excursion to Fakari White Island ended in horror. And I remember feeling my flesh burning and yelling out at one point that just in pain. I checked as soon as the cloud cleared to make sure my wife was okay. <laughs> Sorry. I've never heard him scream like that before. Um, I remember he... I remember he said he was sorry. I was positive we were going to die, and I, if we were going to die, I wanted to be next to him. To be honest, the Americans have travelled to Auckland for the trial, with Mr Yuri telling the court he did not understand what a volcanic level 2 alert meant. Never in my wildest dreams would have gone on that island had I known an eruption was level 3. <laughs> the couple are the first witnesses in WorkSafe New Zealand's prosecution of the volcano's owners and two tourism companies. The regulator alleges not enough was done to manage the risks of running to Ms Yuri told the court she's been having surgery once a month for most of the three and a half years since the eruption. We wanted to have two kids, but um, now I'm considered high risk if I um, do decide to have kids. It has taken over our lives. A glimpse into the devastating and lasting impacts of that dark day. Emily Clark, ABC News.